Welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to have you here today. Like always, if you're not subscribed already, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Today's video, we're going to be doing a weekly reset and boy, do I have one for you. We have a long list of things to get done today. So I'm just going to take you all along with me as I accomplish everything. I need to go to the grocery store. So before I go to the grocery store, I want to get my laundry done and my dishes done. And then I'm going to get a load of laundry started. Um, so we're going to get that done, go to the grocery store. I'm going to go get some fresh flowers and then we have some more stuff to get done when we get back here. So we have a lot to do. So let's get right into today's video. I could be wrapped around your arms instead of being lonely. We could be gazing at the stars, but now it feels just like a Wandered off into a room and closed the door behind me. I never gave the key to you, even though I wanted to. I should be trying something new, but now my body's aching. I'm tired of dwelling in the dark, it's just that my heart can't take it. I didn't know what it would cost me when I let you go. I feel alone. I'm just singing mm, mm, mm. It should have been you Another time, another place I just know mm, mm. It could have been you What a crime and what a shame to let go mm, mm. Sometimes I just don't know what to do It should have been you Drive into your place, but now the crown is shaking. Could be a face, but it feels like it will never go away until we make up. I can't be myself. I never knew how much I needed you. Mm -hmm. It should have been you. Another time, another place, I just know. Crazy 
about to load the washing machine and then I'm gonna head out to the grocery store um I like to start the washing machine before I leave because I hate hearing the noise of it running I think it's because I'm like trying to film and stuff and I just don't like noise but um anyways I'm just going to load this up and start it and then I'm gonna head out Right, we're gonna run through my little grocery haul this was all 53 dollars besides the razor over there that's something different but all the groceries were 53 dollars i got some bogo stuff so my cinnamon rolls were bogo thank goodness so i don't really need any right now but i went ahead and grabbed some and then i've been loving this the zero sugar vanilla greek yogurt because i've been doing the yogurt parfaits at chick-fil-a and they're like $5.99 and this whole thing is $5.99 but with it being BOGO it was only $3 so I also got these to try one of my subscribers actually commented said they made strawberry cheesecake muffins so I went looking for some and I just saw that it says just add milk and I don't have any so I need to go get milk but this I'm probably not going to bake these today but I did want to try these to put in my cake stand and then Rice Krispie Treats were BOGO. The Eternal Water was BOGO. So I went ahead and got some of those to fill my water bottle with. This is stuff I picked up at Walmart, but I just got a hot pink razor. I needed another razor. So I went ahead and got that one. And then I want to try these lashes out. You guys know I do my own lashes and I've been seeing these. These have no glue. They say they just like press on and go. So I'm going to try these out. Um, I love the lashes that I wear, but I'm always down to try something new and with one less step of like having glue so i'll let you know i will let you guys know how that works all right then we just got the yogurt drinks you already know and then the flip cups and all the chobani yogurt was bogo except for the drinks but i went ahead and got this because that's my favorite little treat and then i've been seeing this kaboom spray on tiktok and it changes the color when it's clean and i think it sprays out like purple and then i picked up some of this because i want to clean my hokas i'm about to show you all what they look like right now because of the pollen they're literally yellow after going for two walks yesterday so we're going to clean those with this and then i'm probably going to put my white towels in with that load as well but we will do that right before i have to leave again so i've been getting these bagels they say they're five net carbs there are no added sugar and they're blueberry bagels. And I got a pack last week to try and I really love them. You keep them in the freezer for freshness. Um, what I probably need to do right now is go ahead and cut them all in half. Cause I cut myself like three times trying to slice them right out of the freezer. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and cut them in half because I like to put them in the toaster, but they are really, really good. And I've been using either regular cream cheese or strawberry cream cheese, and that's my favorite snack. So I'm probably about to make that right now and put these groceries away. But this is my little grocery haul. This is $53. And then the razor and the lashes, I think, was like 18 together. All right, so I got my dossier package and I'm so excited because they sent me their new scent and in this box and I'm very excited to try this. This is the from the Speak Easy collection and it says it's one of their originals. So if you haven't heard of dossier, it's like affordable perfume dupes. So like any like high-end perfume that you like, they probably have the dupe on the website. I've been loving the Marc Jacobs Daisy, but I did order two different kinds to try because I know there's probably several more that I love, but this is their original scent that they sent me. So this one is the Fresh Margarita and Lime, and I can't wait to smell it. Ooh, I like that. Okay, yeah, this is like the perfect summer scent. And I love like the hint of lime in it, but it, it smells just like so fresh. Oh, I love that. Okay, this might be my new favorite. This might be my new favorite perfume. All right, and then I just got two other scents. I got something different than Floral Violet because I wanted to branch out and try, but now I know that I really like that one. Um, I think, let's see. Okay, Fruity Almond. This is the inspired by the Carolina Herrera perfume. And I can't remember if I've tried this one before a long time ago, but there was one that was like fruity that I tried. Let's see, let's put it right here. Oh yeah, I like this one too. It says almond and peach is like the top scents in this but that smells very very good but i got the floral rubber i guess that's how you say it rubber this one's inspired by mark jacobs perfect ew i don't know how to say it perfect something perfume all right let's okay that one's really different i like it i don't know if i love it but i really i like it i love anything with like the floral on Dossier's website. But, um, so yeah, go onto the website and thank you so much Dossier for sponsoring today's video. Um, their perfumes range from I think like 29 to 49, maybe even 29 to 59 dollars, I can't remember. But you definitely wanna go check them out because I'm sure they have the perfume that you're using and it literally smells the exact same as the expensive kind and I've tested it out, so.
What if the wind could spread your love? What if your sweetness could reach everyone? There'd be no wars. will sing about your heart maybe the trees will whisper the word maybe the sun will spread your joy to the ones who lost their hope So I finally got my hands on this pink Hydra jug. So this is their new one. It's called the Color Block. So the handle's like orange, the top is lime green, and then the base is like pink, like mine. Well, my pink one was like a limited edition from Black Friday, and I knew when they were advertising for it, I needed it. So like I like sat up and waited for it to go live and ordered it, and then they never made it anymore. Well, I think this pink is very similar to my pink and a lot of you ask about it. So I ordered this one, and as much as I want to keep it for myself because it's so cute and I love all the different colors, it's going to be a part of my giveaway. I think I'm gonna give this and the the new Dossier perfume. Um, I think I'm gonna order one of those for myself because I love that perfume, and give y'all one. And then this, I did end up ordering another Hydro Drug for me. It's a blue one, but this one, like every time they restock, it gets sold out so quickly. And it's already sold out, but I got my hands on it the other day for one of y'all for the giveaway because we're about to hit 20,000 subscribers like very soon, probably next week. So I will be giving this away in a fun little giveaway. And I'm trying to think of one more thing for the giveaway. I was gonna do the Timu robe, but I don't think I could get it in time. But I might go and see if I can find a little something else to go with, with these two items. But I figured this was perfect because this is like my statement piece, my cup I carry with me all the time. And yeah, so I got this and that for the giveaway, but that's very, very exciting things coming so up. It's 11.30 and i have got my package i went to the grocery store so i went and dropped off my vase at the flower shop to be filled so i need to go pick it up my sister works there so i kind of showed her what i want and she's fixing it up for me and we're gonna bring it back so we'll have fresh flowers on the coffee table because oh, it feels so good to have fresh flowers but i'm about to fix me like a snack and something to eat so every day I write in my notebook like what day instead of my planner because I don't know I don't know I like to just stay organized with a notebook so I write down what I need to do for the day and today's list okay, let's see what it says Monday March 25th okay so laundry which we're doing dishes um, package grocery shopping grocery haul we're a pretty good ways down on the list which is great because like I don't know, I feel like on my days where I need to do stuff, the day just flies by so fast and I can't stand that <laughs> um, because I do have spin class at six, but that's really the only structure. And then I'm gonna be filming my five to nine short TikTok, um, reel, whatever you call it, um, after. But that doesn't normally take me very long because it's just like little clips. But yeah, today's a very, very busy day. I do need to ship out some Poshmark packages because I sold a bunch of stuff last week on my Poshmark store and I sold like bundles of stuff. So I have to find like a big mailer. So we need to do that and go to the post office. And that's really about it. Let's get back into it.
Like this chicken salad is my favorite. It's from Walmart. It is so good. It kind of has like a little sweetness to it. I don't know. So I'm going to do like a chicken salad sandwich with the wrap. You said it was the last time, but you keep coming back to tell me. Sorry that you take back all the things you said just to hurt me. Our love just went cold, but I'm still burning. Our love just went cold. Why? I keep on making the same mistake. The bedroom is done. My bed has been made up since last week before I left. So I didn't have to do anything there, but I did just really want to get these floors vacuumed because there was just like lint and stuff all over them. So I feel better having the floors vacuumed for sure. Get over you again. You said it was the last time that you keep coming back to show me. Sorry you have changed now. But it's the same old story I love just went cold But I'm still burning I love just went cold before of my hokas they're basically yellow from the pollen so what i'm gonna do is put um regular detergent in there and then like a, like a little scoop of oxyclean and see if i can't get it out and then i'm just gonna let them air out to dry and i kind of hope that they're dry before spin but it's okay if they're not because i can just wear a different shoe but i'm gonna show you all the after once they're done but we're gonna throw these in the washing machine with some white towels All right, I'm gonna quickly share with y'all my little haul of like some summer staples that I got. And I've just really been struggling because like, I don't know what to wear. All I wanna wear is a t-shirt. All I wanna wear is this t-shirt actually, you know, cause y'all see me in this all the time. I'm like, can anyone make a t-shirt that matches this energy? If you can do it because I need something else like this. Like this is the perfect fit, the perfect colors. Like I love this shirt so much, but I'm like, okay, what else am I gonna wear besides this t-shirt all summer so I went online and I went onto Hollister's website and honestly last year I discovered that Hollister has some really nice clothes um I have like this black pair of flowy pants that I wear all the time from them and so I was like let me go see what they have so 
these are the things I found. So I found these shorts and they're the five inch seams. So they're not like too short and they're super comfortable and stretchy and they're high waisted. So these are their, um, I think they're called the nineties short ultra high rise. And I love the fit of these because I struggle with like my shorts, like they can be perfect right when I put them on. And then when I start walking, it's game over. I have to, I just need to go put pants on. So these are the perfect length. They're not like too long or too short. So I really like these and I think I'm going to be getting some more colors in these, but I love these. Okay, the other thing I got was these little linen shorts. These are so, so comfortable and they've got like the elastic band back here. So they're like super stretchy and comfortable and they're very like, they're very flowy, so they're gonna be perfect for like a really hot day. And they have pockets, and I feel like you can just like really dress these up or dress them down, but I love these. The other thing I got that I'm gonna wear with like both of those shorts is this just like simple little t-shirt, this little white baby t-shirt. It's like really good quality, it's thick, it's not see-through, and I think it'll be perfect to wear with jean shorts or these pants or even my black pants. I think it's perfect, but they have other colors like this and I think I'm gonna get some more because I love like just a simple t-shirt. And then the other thing I got was this pink shirt because you guys know I love pink. And I love anything like bright pink, but this is going to be perfect. I love the high neck. I don't like to wear anything that like comes below here. Like I love high neck stuff. So this tank top is perfect. I think I'm going to also get a couple more colors of this because on Hollis, like on Hollister, you can really find affordable clothes, especially when they're running a sale, which they normally always are. You can find the stuff for like a really good price. It's good quality clothing. And to me, when I think of Hollister, I think of like old, like... That was a long time ago when I wore the shirts that said Hollister on them, but like, no, they really have some good clothing. And they're actually, oh, they, I think they're owned by Abercrombie or they're the same company. So it's almost like Hollister is like a cheaper version of Abercrombie, but like it's the same stuff. So the other thing that I like, the other thing that I like is their bathing suits. Last year I got some bathing suits at Hollister in Hawaii and those are my only bathing suits that I wear. Like those are my favorite bathing suits. So you guys need to check it out if you're looking for just some basic summer pieces. I'm going to leave the link for like the things that I got on here, but I just wanted to quickly share this with y'all because I like to show y'all like what I got and stuff. But this is like just some stuff I got this week that I think I will be able to like mix match and wear this stuff all summer. All right, so I just got these out of the washing machine and I feel like they cleaned up very, very nicely. So this is the bottom, which I really don't care about the bottoms, but I got all the pollen off of them and I had like these little marks right here from um, spin class and those aren't there anymore either. So I'm just gonna let these set out to dry and I'll probably have to wash them again soon because the pollen is so bad, but it was just so easy. I just did a little quick wash with the OxyClean and I washed them with my white towels, which I'm about to fold those. And they came up so, so nice and clean and it was super fast.